scared at first and then I tried it on and I was like, girl, yeah, girl, a swimsuit. So stay tuned for that. This is so attractive, ain't it? So awkward. What's up, y'all? It's Kaylee here. Today I have a really exciting video for y'all. I have a pretty decent size um, Walmart clothing haul along with a few other beauty items that I picked up. So I'm really excited because the first time I did a Walmart haul, um, I ended up getting, I think, 59 views, which that's not a lot, but to me it is because that's the most I've got. And I love Walmart, love shopping at Walmart. I love finding like deals. I'm sorry if y'all hear my son's TV going on. But anyway, so I got about 60 views on that video so far, and that is just like generically through YouTube. I haven't promoted my YouTube on any other social network. Um, I've only told a few friends and family, like four people. So that really made me happy. So I was like, I love doing that. So I'm going to do it again, you know? And um, I went to Walmart today and I got a bunch of cute things. So I'm going to go ahead and get into this haul. Before I start, I did want to mention that I will be having some like shaper panties on in some of this haul um because in my other try on hauls i've had i haven't had on the best like undergarments that you would wear when you're like trying on clothes or whatever and um it doesn't really matter but just for my personal like preference i would like to try on these clothes with this on which is just like some underwear that come up higher um i'm sure the ladies know what i'm talking about it's kind of holding everything in, you know? But um, if I take this off and try something on, I will let you know. That way you can kind of see the difference. And I also want to note that I've already tried all these clothes on actually at Walmart. So I guess they're starting to like open up the fitting rooms again. I'm not really sure, but I was actually surprised that I was able to try these things on at Walmart because I know any other time um, in the past, recently you know the fitting rooms have been closed so anyways and she was kind of rude with me about it too she told me that any clothes that get put back they have to quarantine so i was like okay i was like okay ma'am you know i'll just be a minute or whatever so i hurried up and tried on what i had to try on and girl let me just tell you, I got some goodies behind here that are really cute. Some really cute like spring pieces and I'm so excited to show y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and so for this first kind of outfit, but it's not really outfits. I'm just trying on every piece that I got at Walmart. So when I wear these, you know, I might end up styling them different or whatever the case may be. Y'all know, you know, as women and girls, we tend to try on multiple things until we get like the outfit look that we want. Anyways, these are the first pair of shorts I'm gonna show y'all. It looks like this, and these are by No Boundaries. They're a size 21, girl, so keep in mind, at Walmart, especially this particular brand, they do run a little smaller, okay? And, um, cause I normally run a size 16 in jeans, so, and shorts so this is a bit you know a little bit bigger of a size but it's okay because i know my size and i know what size that i normally get in these particular brands you know so this is no boundaries and they just look like this in the front and then they look like this in the black back just some nice black high-waisted shorts and I, I did try these on they fit me really really well so I'm gonna go ahead and try these on with this shirt right here and also I want to note this is also by no boundaries I want y'all to keep in mind that no boundaries is one of the cheapest clothing brands at Walmart so with the cutest clothes you know what I'm saying so it kind of, you know, evens itself out as long as you know what size and you try things on, you know. The worst thing is to get the wrong size and then come home and you're, like, disappointed because it's too small, you know. So, this is the shirt, the little tie-dye shirt that I got. 
And this is just a basic shirt. This is $7.96 and I got a um, 3XL in this because I wanted it to be big enough to where I could, you know, do a little tie thing and stuff. You know what I'm saying? I decided to take the um, shaver panties off for this outfit because I really would never wear them with this. And um, I just don't feel like they're needed in this particular outfit. Which I don't really wear shaper panties anyways, but I feel like when you're trying things on, you at least sometimes need a good firm, you know, pair of panties. And also, I've gained like 15 pounds, so, yeah. But these shorts fit really, really well, y'all. They come on at a good length, I think, for spring. And I love this detailing right here. Let's see if I can get y'all a, a better view in a minute. Okay, y'all, so I would wear this together. I think it's really cute together. Um, these are usable pockets in these shorts. The back pockets are real as well. So how I would probably style this is just doing the little thing where you tie a little knot right here. Or I would just wear it down, you know, regular, smegular type of girl. But if I'm trying to be cute and like extra, then I will probably try to, you know. Very, very cute, casual shirt could be tied a little better, but I just did it real quick to show y'all. Um, got a little pocket right here. I love the colors on this shirt. They had many different, um, color combinations and yeah these shorts just come at a good length i don't feel like i'm gonna be like pulling them down all day um yeah just super super cute y'all save your tears for another day i wanted to show y'all these shorts i got um, these are just some like lounge, um, like around the house, chores, you know, just comfy shorts. And um, I believe they were like five some, five dollars and some change. So stuff like that's hard for me to not like just pick up. So these are just plain little shorts. So yeah, I just wanted to show y'all these. Um, they do have usable pockets, and I like the way it outlines with the white, which it really doesn't matter. These are just casual, like, play, you know, comfy shorts. Some people would not wear these out of the house. I can tell you that I will. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Next. Okay, y'all, so I kind of started to get ahead of myself, but I wanted to run run it back and say the price on these black shorts is $11.98. So, these are, those are like these nice little black shorts. And the ones I just showed you, the casual shorts, this is by the brand Athletica, Athletic, and, um, that's the size I got and um, 2X and I don't know the price on these so I'm sorry by the way if you're still here in this video give me a thumbs up girl and also um, stay tuned because I have a swimsuit in this video as well yeah girl a swimsuit so stay tuned yeah, I'm not gonna be wearing the shaver panties with that okay what else also, I have an upcoming really big haul for y'all, so be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that way you get notified whenever I drop this, this good stuff, okay? All right. This is so attractive, ain't it? But this is the shape of panties, y'all. So the next shorts I'm gonna be trying on for y'all are um, kind of shaped like the black shorts in the aspect that they are high-waisted. So they have this going on right here, and they are so cute. I love camouflage. These are by the brand Time and & True, and it says 
Um, these were $13.44. And what size? What size? I got these in a size 18. So you see how these Walmart sizes just run different all the time. It says four inch inseam. So I guess that's a good a good little inseam for me, honey, because let me show you what these shorts are about to do. So I decided that I'm only gonna wear the shaper panties with one outfit that I feel like I need them with. Cause I was kind of being like too complicated with that because honestly I never wear shaper panties like in real life. But I know this one outfit like I would, you know, like it needs it. It needs something to kind of give you some shape because it, it's not an outfit that has. Anyways, I'm about to show you all this. So this is what these shorts look like on me. I feel like y'all are so far away, but hopefully you can see. These are so cute, y'all. They fit like perfectly. I got this little tank top. Um, it has XXL. This is by the No Boundaries brand, and it's just a plain tank top, y'all. They have these all the time. I have multiples of these, and yeah, they're just good basic tops to have. So, if I was to style this, I don't know exactly how I would. I just know I love these shorts, and I'll be able to figure out some way to make it work. Here's the damn button. Sweating. So these are these camo shorts y'all and then I just paired it with this little gray tank top. These outfits are just like the, the stuff that I bought, not necessarily like fully, you know, styled outfits. Okay? So, like I'm in love. These shorts are good for fake Like Look how good they're fitting me like right here. I'm so confident right here. And for those of you that got a song y'all know y'all know that it's not always that we confident in that area but these it's like literally camouflaging this area Okay, y'all, this next pair of shorts that I got are in the ultra high rise, extra large. It says 15 to 17. And these were $11.98. Hey! Give me a minute. Y'all, these were $11.98. Now, these have that kind of, I heard those girls say it's like paper bag pants or something. I don't know, but anyways, basically what I'm trying to say is this part up here that kind of like comes up and comes out. This is the back of them. And so when I looked at these at first, I was like, are these going to give me any type of shape? Like, you know, they look really well made though. And um, for... $12, I mean, pair this with a black shirt from the brand Time and True. It's in a size large, and I believe it was like $7.90 something. All right, y'all, so no shaper panties on this one because you don't need them. Um, these shorts are kind of a looser fit. So, like I said, I paired it with this black, um, plain black top, and what I'm gonna do is just tuck this top in which these do unbutton, they're real buttons. And then these are real pockets as well. And you got real pockets back here. So I'm just gonna tuck this shirt in. And button it back up. And then I'm gonna put my pockets in there. Now I feel like this might be something that has to be ironed out a little bit with this belt that I got from Walmart. Cause these are real belt loops. So I thought that was really, really convenient and nice to have on a pair of shorts like this.
belt isn't really tight enough, so it doesn't look right. Okay, so y'all saw where I tried to incorporate the belt into the, like this look or whatever, but that belt was too big and I wasn't about to make a new belt hole and all that stuff. So, you get the idea. You know, this would be so cute with a little belt around your waist and like just a plain basic top. Or this really almost gives me like romper vibes, which I can never in my life find a romper that looks good on my body but guess what i did these are just you know very cute and i like that everything is functional functional pockets they are dark wash i feel like they'll shrink a little bit because i don't like this looseness right here you know but they are meant to be a little bit looser and baggier so I love how they look. Okay, y'all. So this next little outfit, I'm super, super, uber excited about because um, I was kind of like scared at first. And then I tried it on and I was like, girl, yada, 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 yes, ma'am. And this, uh, the brand is called Secret Treasures, which is a brand that I've never heard of before at Walmart. And this is a, in a size large, so a size 12, 14, and this is just what it looks like. It's hard for me to show y'all um, like this, but I will show y'all in a minute, of course. But draw a string right here in the middle, and then it comes in at the bottom like some joggers. And anyways, this is not going to do justice on the hanger, so I'm about to show y'all, but... Before I go ahead and pop this on, these shoes that I got, which I didn't realize until I was about to leave, that these actually kind of match this in a way. So they definitely are like matchy matchy um, in real life, but I don't know if y'all see it or not. I asked my sister and she was like, yeah, that does match. So I'm gonna try these on together. And these shoes are by the brand Time and True. And they are $14.98. So y'all, I was so scared of this before I tried it on because I just don't ever look good in like rompers or anything like that. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my shape panties on for this outfit because I feel like I will, I will like it better. But when I did try it on at Walmart without them, I could I could rock it like that too, but I wanna try it on with them now. Okay, y'all, so this is this outfit. It does have like real jawstrings that work. So I'm gonna tie this up. And like I said, I was super nervous about this and I'm still kind of like a little bit like, uh is this cute? But then, and then I'm like, yeah, it's cute. It's got usable pockets. For spring, just to throw this on. Do we think this is cute? I just wanted to wear it for a minute and see how I was feeling in it today and also I'm not wearing any undergarments at all so uh, when I show y'all this how it looks without you know those um, shaper panties um, just keep that in mind I don't I'm not trying to really flash anybody that doesn't want to be flashed so um, yeah I'm about to just show y'all what this looks like again without any
Well, I think I like it better without the shaver panties because I just like to be comfortable. I think this outfit really looks better in person. But, um... Because um, on the screen, it kind of just looks like it's all going together. But in person, you can clearly see, like, this waistband part. So, this is just a large. So, I'm amazed at, like, how big it is and how much room I have in here. Um, so, definitely go check this out if you're into outfits like this. I love the pockets. And I just love the, the fabric is really, really soft. And I just feel like... Three, I don't, I don't, I literally feel like I don't have any clothes on, which kind of don't because it's the only clothing I have on. What do y'all think about this? So let me try to tie it because my problem yesterday with it was I was kind of feeling like I didn't know where this should go exactly, and it's kind of like the type of outfit. You have to just play around with it for a minute and see where you want it, how you want to do it, you know? So, let's have this. I think this is very, very cute. And I'll most likely be wearing this somewhere. y'all I'm back so yesterday um it was like at night when I was doing my video and my sister and her son is here so my nephew and um yeah we got kids it was a school night and I just couldn't finish what I was doing but um I'm kind of dreading this to be honest I'm just gonna go ahead and do a little disclaimer because for one I'm looking completely different than I was yesterday so that's kind of lame. But anyways, and another thing, um, like I've mentioned, I think I did earlier in this video, I have gained some weight and I've really just been going through some things the past couple months. So I'm not as like confident in my body as I have been, you know, or yeah. So y'all know what I mean. Some of us have depression, you know, eating disorders. So yeah, that's kind of what I've been going through the past couple months. And so I'm not completely confident in my body, you know. But um, I'm still confident enough to try on this bikini. And I want everybody to just know that you're beautiful the way you are. That's so like, um, what's the word? Corny, I guess. But it's true. And like, who? beauty is in the eye of the beholder, really. So somebody could think that you're disgusting and then somebody else could be like you know bowing down at your feet so we're just gonna pretend like i okay we're gonna pretend like we went to the beach and that's why my hair looks like this i did just take a shower but we went to the beach okay so we're gonna just ew we're just gonna act like i went to the beach and that's why i look like this and yeah i'm about to try on this bathing suit for y'all bottoms because let me show y'all the bottom so this is the bathing suit right here all right i'll show y'all the top first so i did try on the top this is what the top looks like so cute it has like this little like metal part right here that goes down and um this is the back so so cute it does have padding in there which i think i will leave in there 
but um I don't know it just depends on how the bathing suit wears you know and how I feel in it when I'm actually going to the beach but I am today so we'll see but um yeah it's just this really pretty like mauve like neutral tone and I hope it's coming up good on camera because it does have more of a pinkish tone to it in real life like especially like this part and like the main background color is very like mauvey pink so it does have adjustments and everything and I thought that this this is in a size um <clears throat> this um piece was 16.88 and I got it in the size extra large um which is 16 to 18 which is my correct size I didn't try the bottoms on because I already could tell that I really felt like they were going to fit good. So I just kind of took my chances on it, you know, and I knew that I could bring it back if I didn't like it. But I knew that the bottoms were going to be really cute because look at the back of them. So anytime you see like this little ruching, it's not picking up on camera, but y'all know what I mean. It's like a little booty ruching right there. That really just, um, I guess kind of accentuates. Is that a word? <laughs> I look ugly. Okay, so. Anyways, y'all, that part at the bottom, it just kind of, and it goes all the way down. So it just kind of scrunches in the booty area a little bit. And it just complements my booty. So... I'm sure it'll look good on y'all as well. And um, you can kind of see it better right there. Can y'all see that? I don't think you can see, but you know what I'm saying. And then on the sides, it just has like this detailing right here. Okay, there we go. That's kind of what it looks like better. Okay, so this bathing suit all together is in the brand Time and True. And I got also got an extra large in the um, bottom. So, yeah, I'm about to put this on for y'all and try it on. I told them, give me something good. I might come back. I did put a panty liner in the, um, what's a good word to say? In the booty part, I guess. The vagina area of these um these bottoms so just to protect myself because i didn't wash it before i tried it on so whatever whatever i need to look in the mirror before i let y'all see me So this is what this two-piece looks like on me. I'm going to uh, put in a clip of a different view, like kind of the other way, so y'all can really just be on my level and see. This is the back. Okay, y'all. So first, I'm going to talk about the top. Um, this, in my personal opinion, is a really, really good top for my type of like chest. Um, I don't have the biggest boobies in the world. My body type is just really kind of evened out and um, I feel like if I lost weight, then my boobs would be even smaller than they are. So that's why I have that issue where sometimes the cup size is like huge and it doesn't, you know, anyway. So I think this is really, really cute. And it fits me well. It has some structure on the side right here. So it kind of stays straight right there and doesn't like crumble, you know? And then I love this part because like I said, I don't have that much boob. So this kind of creates like some cleavage right there, you know? So, and it does have some padding, which I don't know if I will end up leaving in or not. And this is the back. Very, very cute in the back. And then I absolutely love the way the bottoms fit on me as well. They come up at the very, like the perfect 
spot that they could come up, that's where they come up. And the ruching like really just makes your butt look good. So overall, I absolutely love this bathing suit and um, like I don't want to sound like I'm not confident in my body and stuff, but sometimes I'm really not and especially when you like gain some weight. Um, so don't let my like vibes rub off on y'all because I do think I look very, very good and like a snack in this bathing suit i love this bathing suit and i know that when i lose the weight that i had already lost so basically i lost some weight and then i gained it back yeah so of course i'm not gonna feel like good about myself because of that reason but i do love this bathing suit i think it's really well fitting i love the pattern of it i love just like the way it looks on my body so Look at the booty on this bathing suit. Up at like the perfect, you know? This is what we do at the beach sometimes. We'll wear shorts. Look how cute. So, so cute. So, so, so cute. So, so cute. So cute, so, so cute. Look at the back of this bathing suit. It fits me so good. So, so good. Beach vibes. I should just pretend like I'm at the beach all day. So I have a few more things that I wanted to show y'all that I picked up. Um, first, I'm gonna show y'all these little um, shorts that I got for Eli because this was part of my haul as well. I got these in a medium and they're by the brand Wonder Nation and it, they were $9.96. So I just thought these were so cute. They have a little detailing on the back in one pocket and these are going to be just so cute for Eli for spring. Um, by the way, I've already picked him up some clothes. Um, so like Walmart, usually I just go to Walmart all the time and if I see like some cute items or some basics for Eli, then I always pick him up, stuff like that. Um, this next item I got is by NYX, NYX. And it is the three steps to sculpt. And my nephew has already got in this and tried to destroy it. So that's great. But um yeah, I've already used this. I like the way it works. And my other bronzer, my wet and wild bronzer got broke. So I had to get me another bronzer. Then I got these two um, wet and wild lippies. So this one is wet and wild liquid catsuit. This is in the shade Sin Nudes. So that's really cute. Then I got this one. It's the wet and wild cloud pal and this is in the shade um love you s'more oh so that's what that looks like and i figured i could kind of use these together and do like a a little ombre lip or something i don't know these are pretty cheap and affordable so they they got my money all right am i missing anything do y'all like this bathing suit? Big girls can wear two pieces, can wear crop tops. You can wear whatever you want to wear. So don't let nobody tell you different. I really love this. Even with me gaining my weight, I still love this. And if I need to wear a bathing suit somewhere, I might wear this one because I don't care. I don't care. Okay. I can be fabulous and cute too, honey. Yes, ma'am. I genuinely love every piece that I got and I'm really excited about it. I'm really excited about warm weather in general. If you've watched any of my videos, then you probably know that. I feel like I'm about to like slowly come back to life again. But um, yeah, I hope you liked it. I hope you saw something you liked and you can run to Walmart real quick and see if they have it in your size. 
Also, like I mentioned before, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure you turn on your notifications because I have a huge clothing haul coming up. So if you are a girl that is you know, my size or around my size or maybe just a bigger girl or maybe you're not big at all and you just want to see what, um, you know, what's out there in clothing or whatever. I am by no means like a fashionista or nothing like that. I literally was thinking about it earlier and I don't even know like my measurements for any, any part of my body because I really change so quick and like I said, I'll have my my ups and downs where I might lose like 15, 20 pounds and be looking good, girl. And then I'll, I'll flip and I'll just, you know, anyways, I have issues. Okay. Period. Period. Okay. But, um, yeah, I really enjoy doing these hauls just because clothing excites me in general. I love when I find something that like fits good, you know, don't we all? So, yeah, I'm about to edit this video. Um, I hope y'all have a great week, a great day. Today is Tuesday. So, yeah. Anyways, yeah. Love y'all.